Well, when you lose an animal, you then begin the process of trying to find it, like a lost dog. In the past, you probably depended on a flyer posted on a telephone pole or an ad in the newspaper. Cakes Jordan Shefty is here now, and Jordan, now there are, there are new ways to post information about a missing pooch, right? That's right, Mike. Thanks to the internet, there are more outlets you can turn to to track down man's best friend. With options like Facebook and Craigslist available, you might have a little more help with your hunt for Fido. I think the unknown is the worst. Not knowing if he's with somebody that's treating him good, if he's, if he's, been killed. Andrea Gira's Yorkie Bailey has been missing for two weeks now. Every day has been an emotional roller coaster. When she began her search, she used the typical outlets. She hung signs, posted ads in the paper, and visited the animal shelter. But when all of those came up empty, she turned to her computer. I was very surprised. I mean, I've never lost a pet before. Unknown to her, there were a number of websites set up devoted to helping find lost pets in Wichita. You get a much broader group of people helping you with using the internet. Lisa Hebert is the administrator for the Facebook page called Wichita Area Lost and Found Pets. I was thinking, Facebook is where it's at. Um, everybody has Facebook. She visits approximately 15 lost pet websites almost hourly and posts links to the missing animals on her page. It seems like some people know about Craigslist, some people know about the Facebook app, some people know about the paper. It doesn't seem like everyone knows of all the outlets. Lisa says that close to 100 pets go missing daily here in Wichita, but with more than 1,200 followers on her Facebook page, the canine quest can reach more households and extend beyond the neighborhood. We get pets back home daily, um, a lot less Tears. Andrea is just hoping to be reunited with Bailey so her tears can turn to happy ones. I mean, it would just be amazing. It would be like the best gift right now for our family. I mean, it just doesn't feel complete without having him. Andrea says that she has received the most feedback from her ad in the newspaper, but thinks that might just be because people who find dogs don't know that there are other places you can look. She's hoping that by doing this story, more people will become aware of outlets available for missing or found pets. Well, and of course, this applies to cats as well. We don't want the cat lovers to think we're forgetting them. They said cats, turtles, yeah. anything that means a lot to you, they'll go out and look for I it. I know my dog won't run away. I've actually left the gate open for days because he knows how well my wife takes care of him <laughs> in the food department. Life's too good. Life's He's not wandering good. off. He's huh? not going to run away. Thanks, <laughs> Sounds Jordan. Sounds good. Thanks, Mike.